Hi everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in today's video we are going to be doing a My Protein unboxing haul. So I work with My Protein for those of you who don't know. I have been working with them for around two years now. I started working with them in 2018 I'm sure. So Today we are going to be doing an unboxing haul. I receive my monthly order, so that's what we're going to be going through today. I do work with my protein, but I haven't been asked to film this video. This is just all on my own terms. And I have done one of these before, but it was like away at the beginning of last year and I feel like I'm a different person <laughs> from what I was in that video. I looked back at it and I was like, oh my God, I have changed so much. So I do have a little code for my protein which is just Lucy and that will give you 37% off. However, that does change depending on promotions etc. But I think at the minute it is 37% off. But I will put in the description below my code and the discount that it gives and I'll also put my link in the description. So if you shop through it, thank you so much. I do... I do get a tiny bit of commission from the link however the code and the link both just support me with the brand and it allows me also to get these gifted orders every month so yeah thank you so much this month's order is such a big order like I have this box and then wait do you see this this box this is honestly huge Um, so I'm not even gonna lie I'm excited so yeah because it was such a big order I was like I might as well film it because this is exciting I'll let you see what I got for the month so let's just get right in I guess of course I've already opened these boxes because like I said I've took a couple of things out already just because I had to use it and I've been meaning to film this for about four days, but I've just been super busy with work. But I have time in between clients just now, so that's what I'm doing. It's something in this video. Um, a lot of big plastic paper things come in it. I've put them all in the bin, but I think it's super unnecessary. And I think that's something they could work on, is unnecessary amounts of plastic in their packaging. But anyways, let's get into the video. So first one, we have coat... So first item, we have the Core Backpack in black. I've been excited to open this, but I've been saving it for the video. I'm supposed to be into the gym. I can't even open this. Is there an easy way to open this? Because at least... There we go. I'm sitting trying to break it from the middle. Anyway... Oh, I like this. So this is just a little backpack and it's like this. So you've got the MyProtein brand in here and you've also got a little zip at the front. Just going to have a little look inside. So you've got a good amount of space in the front zip and then we also have the main bit. I'll open this. There's quite a lot of room in here. Great wee backpack. I think I'll definitely be taking this to the gym today and it'll come in handy for like work etc. I'm just cutting about. Um, but yeah, great wee backpack. I think I'll take this with me today. Oh, it's also got the little MP on the zips which is quite subtle but also nice. I'm not even sure if you can see. But yeah, nice wee backpack. So that is item number one. So here we have a shaker. I just needed a new shaker for my protein shakes because I've been using my little straw bottle from my protein which is not a good idea because the protein literally sticks to the sides. So I needed a new shaker bottle so that's what we got. Again, unnecessary amounts of packaging in my opinion. That's something they could work on. I could never go wrong with too many shakers. For some reason I always lose them. So every month I'm just like why not let's just get another one because I lose them all the time. Can't find them anywhere and I have so many 
bottles I kid you not anyways and again unnecessary amounts of packaging in my opinion that's something they could work on but yeah I'm just going to take that out of the packaging so this is meant to make it easier for your protein to mix this little thing here all this packaging nice and neat out of the way so I'm not making a pure mess third item we have in box number one is flavour drops I haven't got flavour drops from my protein in a while so I'm excited about this. I got the vanilla flavour drops. So it looks like this once that focuses. Come on, focus. So here is the flavour drops. So the good thing about the flavour drops is they have no fat, no calories and no sugar. So like you're winning basically and it can come they have so many flavors and the drops just depending on what you want the drops for i personally use them in yogurt just to give for example greek yogurt some flavor you can also use them in coffee instead of putting sugar in it so yeah i don't know if you've seen my first my protein unboxing haul but you should have seen the state of me it was my first time getting the flavor drops and i was trying to like 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 squeeze them out and the lid wasn't even off but anyways you take the lid off and then you just drop yeah I wanted to get the vanilla ones I don't really drink tea or coffee but I do like an iced latte occasionally so I think I'm going to try and make my own at home iced vanilla lattes so I think these will come in handy for when I give that a try so yeah that's why I got those but yeah they smell good so I'm really excited to try this. Maltodextrin carbs. So I just get the unflavoured maltodextrin carbs. And for those of you who don't know, I have been using maltodextrin carbs for about two years. Every time I go to the gym, I put my maltodextrin carbs into my drink for the gym. And you don't even taste them. They just You just mix it in with your drink and it's got 50 grams of carbs per serving so comes in so handy especially for during the gym so yeah serving size is one and a half scoops which is 50 grams of pro not protein carbs and 200 calories as well in a serving so if you struggle to reach your calories and your carb intake then these can come in so handy you can even just add them to a shake as well yeah, I absolutely love my multidextrin carbs. So that is the next one. Some more multidextrin carbs. Here we have creatine. So got some more creatine. My protein, honestly, is so reasonably, reasonably priced. And on top you can also use my discount code so honestly a lot of the stuff works out super cheap so creatine if you didn't know is actually one of the most safest and most well researched supplements there is on the market and it is proven to be effective and has so much research and studies behind it to prove that it actually works creatine helps with your energy system can improve your performance you can go longer without fatiguing for example because every single day i just put it into my drink with my maltodextrin carbs however i don't use the carbs on my rest days but i still have one scoop of creatine on my rest days so yeah a big myth surrounding creatine is a lot of people seem to think that it's going to make them look super bloated and hold on to so much water um, what I'm going to say about that myth is it does draw water in, however it is intramuscle so the water is going into your muscles, it's not outside so it won't make you look like big or bloated, it might just make you look a little bit fuller just because of the water going into your muscles but that is all I can say about that, that is a myth. Yeah. little chat about creatine overall such a good supplement i absolutely recommend it just due to the benefits it has performance wise and health wise such a good supplement 
anyways, moving on. Box number one out of the way. Let's go on to the big box. So, some snacks. We have protein flapjacks. I absolutely love these. So good. So it has 20 grams of protein per bar. It has 326 calories. It has 12 grams of fat, 4.8 grams of saturated fat, 31 grams of carbs. It's quite high in sugar, 19 grams of sugar. It has 7.4 grams of fiber, 20 grams of protein, and that is that. I love these little bars. So yeah, just be wary of the sugar contents in this if you do go for the protein flapjacks. However, they are such a good little snack. Love them. You get, is it 12? Yeah, you get 12 bars in the box. So, love them. So, next little snack, we have protein wafers. And I got the flavoured chocolate. I also love these. I just had to stock up on the snacks because I hadn't actually got myself any for a good while and I do love a little snack here and there. Come in quite handy especially if you're on the go. So yeah. Um some nutritional value for the protein wafer. We have 195 calories per serving, 9 grams of fat, 6 grams of saturated fat, carbs. For carbohydrates we have 13 grams sugar 5.5 grams of sugar, so way lower sugar contents than the flapjacks. So just be wary about that. The protein flapjacks have 19 grams of sugar, whereas the protein wafers only have 5.5 grams of sugar, and they're also lower in calories as well. Protein Choc Krispies. I love these little things so much. If you have had Rice Krispie Cakes, it literally tastes like that. So yeah, I've got chocolate. Um, I just, I just love these. I haven't had them in a while because they had been sold out. But mm, so excited! They honestly, they honestly do look like Rice Krispie cakes as well, and they taste a bit like them. But they're high in protein, which is great. So description: mini crunchy we isolate crisp ball clusters covered in milk chocolate. So nutritional info, we have per 100 grams, bear in mind this is only 28 grams, this little packet is 28 grams, so however the nutritional info it's given is per 100 grams, so just keep this in mind, the info I'm giving is going to be like three and a half packets worth, but per 100 grams we have 469 calories, um, 18 grams of fat, of which saturates, 11 grams. Carbs, 51 grams, of which is sugars, 32. Protein, 25 grams. However, bear in mind, that's per 100 grams. This is only 28 grams. So, yeah, just keep that in mind. These are, these are great. I 100% can, I can, I recommend those protein crispies. Next, we have a clear way. I love, love, love the Clear Ways. If you haven't tried the Clear Way, I recommend trying it. They do vegan options as well. So yeah, this is a limited edition flavour and I'm sure it's limited edition and it's in the flavour Cherry Blossom. I need to try this because I think I've tried like every single Clear Way flavour. My favourite one so far is the grape flavour. So if you are looking to try out one, I recommend grape, but I also love the cranberry and raspberry. I love peach tea, bitter lemon. I'm not a fan of the rainbow candy. However, most of the other flavours I love. Put a scoop in with your water, you mix it, and it's just like drinking diluting juice, or in England you would say squash. It's just like drinking that. So good. So if you don't like milky, thick protein shakes, personally I don't. I've never been able to drink them. So... It's never been an option for me. I would always put it in a smoothie if I was having any other protein. Um, but for the clear way, I can just drink it like juice. It goes down so easily and it tastes great as well. Um, sometimes I actually put a scoop and a half in 
or I put two scoops in just because sometimes I could be lacking protein and I just need to up my protein intake so I'll put in two scoops and it just goes down so easily so yeah recommend the clear way if you haven't tried it already and don't like those milky protein shakes so moving on we have bcaa drinks so i got the pack of lemon and lime six cans and a pack of the cherry cola which i haven't actually tried yet it has 180 mg caffeine and zero sugar so these are perfect i usually just take them to the gym with me and five grams of bcaa in them in terms of the bcaa's i don't find bcaa is a necessary supplement um i just think they're an unnecessary supplement so don't waste your money on bcaa's that's just my opinion um however this these kind of work as an energy drink so i usually just take them to the gym with me and they're great i love the lemon and lime flavor so recommend those. just a few more things to go so next one i have vegan protein blend and chocolate so i get the vegan option just because it's much better for my stomach so i i find this handy in smoothies like chocolate banana smoothies i like making those occasionally so that's why i got the chocolate flavor i also got another way but i've, I've used it already for my oats and it wasn't vegan because i don't find the vegan protein mixes very well with oats so i just got another protein for my oats i think i got vanilla moving on we have what's this a little crop top i got the women's energy crop top i've also got this in black and red i think so this is what it looks like i just thought it'd be super handy for wearing over a sports bra and the back got the little mp sign here and yeah super cute it's also like kind of ruffled at the front if that makes sense so yeah love that and that is the women's energy crop top okay i actually already have this sports bra but oh, two seconds i'm sure ruffling this packaging so i actually already have this sports bra however there's nothing better than a fresh white sports bra so i just went why not i'll just get another one um so it is the women's essential training sports bra and this is what it looks like so that's the front and then the back it's super strappy i would say support wise mm, low to medium i don't have much chest going on i don't really have much going on in the chest department so i find it quite hard sorry so i find it quite hard when it comes to describing the support of sports bras but it's a great wee sports bra it's so cute and it doesn't come like right down at the front either which is good it kind of like sits up so i'm not sure i would say low to medium support i love 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 a fresh white sports bra so that's what we have there moving on we have leggings okay so for my protein leggings i would always say size up because they are very i just find them small made so I would recommend sizing up so I got a medium in these leggings that I'm about to show you especially the seamless leggings I would size up in I find them super tight these are the women's shape seamless ultra leggings and I just got a little black pair that is the leggings where's the front so yeah that is the leggings so the waistband's quite long but there's no stretch like to these leggings that is why i would say size up so i got a medium there's no stretch like like literally there's not a lot of stretch going on there's more stretch going on on the leg than there is at the waistband so i would recommend sizing up still some subtle contouring detail going on on the back i'm not sure if you can see but it's so subtle but it's it's there um which is nice so yeah 
super simple but I feel like black leggings can be such a staple piece in your collection so I would recommend these leggings. I have got other um, pairs of these leggings which I do like but I do recommend sizing up so that's just something to keep in mind. Size up if you're in between sizes go for the bigger size. I'm usually a small but I, I personally find a medium better fitting for me. Last little item we have the Women's Essentials Puffer Jacket in the colour Rose Water and I got a size small so I'm hoping this fits but I love the My Protein Jackets. I've had one before and I still love it so much. It was last year or was it the start of this year I got it? Um, it was a big pink like puffy jacket and it was such a cute pale pink colour. Honestly I, I just I loved it so I was excited to try this. Ooh. I honestly think this is quite similar to the one of the one I had before. Anyways, give it a wee try. So I have just put the jacket on and it fits perfectly. I love it so much. So just put the hood up and see what the hood's like. The last hood on the other jacket was so big. Yeah, this hood's perfect. I love it. Ah! Especially as it's coming to autumn winter, like I needed a new little jacket like this. Um, Lengthwise, it comes to about, wait, I'll stand up straight. I'm not sure if you can see. It comes to like just below the butt. Yeah, so the hood is also removable as well, which I've just noticed because I nearly like ripped the whole thing off while I was putting it on. Um, zip, we'll zip it up. Yeah, so it comes up to the chin. Love, don't want to get makeup all over it. But yeah, it's so cute. You've got the little, I always say little. You've got the MP, where did it go? There, so cute. Super subtle. My mum's running the bath, so I'm sorry if you can hear that racket. Favourite thing that I've got from the order this month. I love, love, love their jackets and I'm so happy they've come out with more. Um, pockets. They've got the little button pocket. It's not a zip, so it's buttons. But it's super... Oh, it's fluffy inside. Oh, So it's fluffy. They're quite deep as well. Like, my whole hand fits in the pocket. Um, you've also got one on the other side. It's weird, the inside of the jacket's not fluffy, but the pockets are really fluffy, so it'll keep your hands nice and warm if it's cold and you put your hands in your pockets, you get me? But yeah, I'm so happy with this month's order. Oh my God, that is everything. So that is everything from this month's order. I really enjoyed filming it on a YouTube video rather than just doing stories on my Instagram because it means I can go into detail a little bit more on YouTube but yeah supplements we'll just chat quickly about supplements supplements are not necessary you do not need supplements however they do have their place and they can be very beneficial for example protein if you don't get enough protein from your food and your diet then protein supplements be can come in handy and can be necessary Supplements are not necessary, they are a supplement for a reason because they supplement your diet and your training, they just don't do it for you. However, I hope this video was helpful, especially if you are wanting anything from my protein and unsure what to get, I hope that you found this video a little help. So yeah, I just wanted to share what I got for this month because it was such a big order and I am so grateful to anyone who uses my code or shops through my link because it allows me to get these monthly orders and it obviously supports me with the brand as well. So if you do use my code, remember it is Lucy and it should give you 37% off but again it just depends on the promotional period that my protein runs. If you do use my code or you shop through my link then please comment down below and let me know what you get or feel free to give me a little message on Instagram. My Instagram username has actually changed. It's no longer Lucy Means Fit. It is now Lucy Means underscore so yeah. No longer got the fit in it but 
just so you know for when you're searching me up on Instagram. I will link my Instagram down below and I'll also put my my protein link down below as well if you do choose to shop through it. Thank you so much if you do and again just comment below or give me a wee message on Instagram and let me know what you get because I'd love to know and I would also like to thank you personally if you do use my code or shop through my link. But yeah I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching. I will be sure to get more videos filmed. I'm so sorry, I've just been so busy with work. Um, but I really do want to start filming more videos. I just I just get a little lost sometimes and don't know what to film. So if you have any ideas, then please also just let me know. But yeah, thank you so much if you've took the time to watch this video. And I will hopefully see you in the next one. Bye!